Hello friends, welcome back to my channel, Rachel Reviews. We have a watchable unboxing, it is the Happy Holidays style edit. So let's open her up. And I'm wearing green with red lipstick. I usually always wear red lipstick, but I thought it was like holiday-ish, you know what I mean? And we're opening her up, of course, with our trusty rusty screwdriver. Here we go. The Happy Holidays edit. Um, yeah, you guys, it's the holiday season. Do you have all your shopping done? I don't. I think I really only have like two more people to buy for. So I'm pretty much almost kind of done, but I haven't, I've wrapped a couple things, but that's what gets me is like all the wrapping you have to do. You know what I mean, wrapping. Um, <laughs> but we're doing the Happy Holidays Wantable. If you haven't tried Wantable, there's a link below with all my referral links for all the boxes and stuff I do. Um, they send you seven items. They have themed edit boxes. And then this one I think has a gift with it. I think it's like a necklace, like a statement necklace. You guys remember statement necklaces? Like 10 years ago, it was all about the chunky big necklaces. And now I just wear this like little dainty gold one all the time. But here we go. Here's our bundle. She looks slippery. She looks different from both sides, just like me. Um, okay, here's one side. Here's the other. She's slippery. All right, she's looking pretty sparkly. Okay, the necklace did fall out of the bundle already. They send you the mailer to send back the things you do not want. Okay, I haven't looked at it. You ready? Woo, she is bright and sparkly. My God, my God. Okay, let's put her on. <laughs> yeah, here it is. <laughs> it's very pretty, it's very sparkly. I don't really see me wearing this on a day to day, but if you had an event, which I did have an event to go to uh, last weekend for my husband's work, um, so this would have been nice then maybe, but gosh, I feel like the queen. What if it's just like, what if I were to work just like peeking out like this? It's kind of, it's kind of pretty. We'll leave it on for now. It's heavy. It is heavy. Um, find my note. Dun dun dun. Hi Rachel, it's your season to shine. It was such a joy to select, select these seven styles for you so you can slay this holiday. I just know you'll love all the fun pieces that will take you from cozy to cocktails. It's nice to see you for another edit. Happy to include six items from your wish list. That's exciting. Love the pieces you chose, that will be perfect. Hashtag OOTDs for the holidays. The green boss from Lush Scream Sophistication. It'll pair beautifully with the midi skirt I added from Mince Camuto. I also grabbed some cute and cozy statement pullovers that you can pair uh, with the high-rise skinny jeans from Vervet for a chic and cozy look. Find your fave festive fit over the next five days and be sure to polish it off with the free sparkly statement necklace. Wishing you a happy holiday season. Enjoy. Violi. Stylist. Well, thanks. Wonderful. All right, <laughs> let's get going. Here's the first sparkly thing. Ooh, she's, this is the skirt, you guys. I was thinking this might be a top. <gasps> I actually kind of really like, hey right now, I actually kind of really like it. It has, um, like this is an overlay, and so it's shorter than this part. And it, it has like a little slit right there. <gasps> it's kind of cute. That's kind of cute. I like it. All right, and we have a kind of tinsel threaded plaid, which is also cute. I don't have any, I really only have, do I just have one plaid shirt? Whenever I wear plaid, I feel like I look like a lumberjack because, you know, I don't know. I feel like it looks better on other people. I'm sure everyone feels that way about themselves, but I like this one. I thought it was cute with the tinsel kind of run through it. <laughs> okay, oh my god, it's so soft inside. Okay, ready? Extra spicy. I don't really know how this is like kind of holiday themed, but I liked it. It says extra spicy. <laughs> I thought it was fun. And it's very, very soft. It's like a sweatshirt material. And we have, ooh, this is the green shirt. Oh, it's a, oh, it's like actually a full wrap shirt. I saw this on the stream and I thought it was like a faux wrap, so this probably won't 
fit very well, I'm thinking. But it's the same kind of like green, shiny kind of tone. Um, but it's a full wrap. So we'll see. We'll see. And here's some jeans. Ooh. I kind of like them. I have Vervet. They have some distressing on the pocket and distressing on the bottoms. On the bottoms. I like Vervet. I think I've kept a pair from them before from somewhere. And we have, oh, she's really soft too. It's kind of like a cozy pullover, just a neutral kind of cream color pullover. And this one's really heavy. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. That's kind of cute. That's kind of cute too. It's really heavy. My arms are tired from holding everything up. Um, so yeah, let's try everything on. Okay, here's the first look. I like it. I do like it. I'm sure this sweatshirt though is probably like $60. I don't remember how much things are. But I like this skirt too. I was going for like a little like casual fancy with the sweatshirt skirt combo. Um, but yeah, here is the skirt. I think it's pretty cute. I don't really have anywhere to wear it. Like, I, I, the only fancy thing that I ever go to is my husband's work thing, and we already did that, so. Otherwise, like, this skirt's pretty cute with a little slit right there. It's kind of form-fitting. Yeah, I think it's cute. Um, this, this sweatshirt's very cozy. Very, very cozy. I like it. I like the color. I think it's cute. Look how sparkly this skirt is. Okay, let's try the green top with the skirt. Okay, here's the green top with the skirt. If the top fit a little better, I think this would be really cute holiday outfit. Like the sheen of the top, and it's kind of got like, like a slight texture to it. But yeah, here, I mean, it's got a modesty snap right there, so even if you wanted to have that undone, it would be showing. Um, I guess I could like try to pull this a little bit more, but it is cute. I think my bust is just too big for like an actual wrap top. But the skirt's really cute and it's really comfortable. You don't feel like the sequins at all because there's like this slip part underneath. So it's really cute. I think it's a really cute outfit with some minor alterations, you know what I mean? Cute. Well, let's do more. Well, yeah, I got that Christmas tree out back that you wanted. Let me just go get my axe and I'll chop it down for you. Yeah, <laughs> even the tinsel can't save this one. I think if it were a bigger size, which I think they sent a large and I wanted extra large in shirts with buttons, um, you know, for obvious reasons. But otherwise, it's soft, it's comfy, it's got the cute little tinsel through it. Um, the jeans are really nice. I like the way the jeans fit. I'm in between sizes right now, so it's so hard, you know? But I like the way they fit. They feel comfy. They're a little looser. I'll just try to <laughs> give some shape. Um, yeah, I think the jeans are nice. Let me show you the bottom. I think they're a straight leg. Um, not skinny. I can't tell, but I think they're cute. I like the color, I like the distressing. They're nice, let's do more. Is it crazy that I like this the best so far? Besides the jeans? I know it's just a cream sweatshirt, but I think it's really soft and classic looking and you can dress it up. I could throw this necklace on. <laughs> you know? Well, okay, yeah, let's put this on real quick. This is so throwbacky. Just putting on like a plain top and then putting like a huge statement necklace on over it. I could. This could be a look, you guys, for casual Christmas. Do you guys remember those tops? They would be like a sweatshirt like this, but then they'd have this like all around the neckline. That's kind of the vibe it's giving. Kind of cute. It's really soft. This is really stretchy down here. The sleeves are nice. 
I like it. I like it the best so far. I think it's cute. What do you guys think? Close up. I could do it. Dare me? Cheers! <laughs> I think if this were in a different color, maybe. I don't know. I think the black is just too much with like this being so, the lettering being so big too. I don't know. What do you guys think? Be nice. It's like tunic length. It's got a split down the side. I don't know. I think the black is just too much. I, I feel like I don't look the best in black. I don't know. I've just been wrestling with that idea lately. But it's soft. It's very warm, you know. I don't know. I think I like, I think I just like the cream sweatshirt better out of everything. Besides these jeans, they're very comfortable. Um, yeah, I don't know. What do you guys think? Let's go over prices and we'll see what I'm going to keep. Prices. Here we go. I think that was a pretty good Happy Holidays box. Um, depending on like what uh, events you have to go to, I think there's kind of something in there for everything. A little fancier, a little sparklier, a little more low key. I think this was nice, it was a nice box. All right, the High Rise released Hem Ankle Skinny in Denim, uh, $79. Hmm. Oh, it says I requested these July 17th, 2021, by the way. Um, <laughs> And then there's the Classic Crew Sweatshirt in Stone by Z Supply, $59. So the one that I like, $59. Um, I do have credit from one of you guys using my referral link, so I, re I really appreciate that because then it helps me get more boxes because, you know, I have, I have some money towards it to, to use, so I really appreciate it. Um, the Tinsel Plaid Shirt in Black Cabernet Foil by Thread and Supply, $61. The Side Slit Sequin Skirt, say that five times fast, Side slit sequin skirt in rich black by Vince Camuto, 79. The Cheers oversized pullover in black by Hem and Thread, 69. The long sleeve collared surplus top with side tie by Lush, 59. And the extra spice, extra spicy, graphic pullover in Cabernet uh, by 78 and Sunny, $68. So. The styling fee was $21.20 because I, they tax the styling fee for some reason. Um, so, and then I do have $25 in credit from you guys. Thank you. So, I think I'm going to keep this one and it'll cost me like, let's do math. 25 plus 21 is 46 and that shirt's 59 so it cost me like $13. So, I really appreciate it. Well, you know, technically it cost me $23. 420, you know, because that 2120 I've already spent towards the box. Um, but yeah, I really, I really like it. The whole box, $474. If you keep five or more, you get 20% off. Um, so after my styling fee credit, and if I kept, you know, five or more, $355.75 for the whole box. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of cheddar. So yeah, I will not be doing that. I don't think I've ever kept a whole box of stuff from Lonable. I think one time I kept five things. And got the discount but that was like a summer box and i don't know things are a little cheaper in summer i feel like because there's less to the items themselves um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you have a great holiday on um, my next um unboxing i think it's going to be a stitch fix kind of like holiday themed box so keep an eye out for that and uh, i will see you next time